Welcome Taurus, I am the Empress. I'm happy to be here with you guys today. Let's go ahead and take a look into February, okay? So this energy can be vice versa. This could be your energy. This could be someone that you're dealing with. This could be cross watchers energy, okay? Don't get too caught up if the message does not apply to you and then let it fly, okay? This is for who needs it, okay? If it does not resonate, guys, check your moon and your rising, okay? So let's get into it. Let's get into some things, baby. Let's see. Taurus. This message is for Taurus, okay? All right. I got a jumper. All right. What message is there for Taurus for February, please? What message is there for Taurus? Taurus, I feel like you guys are waiting, okay? I feel like you guys are waiting. We got a few that jumped, okay? We got you guys' this energy at the bottom of the deck, okay? You're tired of regretting something or feeling regretful, okay? You're tired of feeling like... <clears throat> you're tired of feeling like you're missing out or you missed the opportunity or, you know, you're tired of feeling like, you know, you're regretting something, Okay, I pick up here that you guys could be waiting on something. We got the waiting game. All right. But I feel like you're ready to speak out. Okay. I feel like you're trying your best, okay, to be victorious and successful in a situation. We got fertility. This is the mother card. Okay, this is the mother card. There could be a feminine energy involved okay this could be your mother this could be um a girlfriend this could be um a baby mother something to that nature this could also be a pregnancy as well okay so maybe some of you guys are waiting to find out if you're pregnant but we got someone being unsure okay we got mental conflict okay and more waiting more waiting all right so i feel like you're you're doing your best okay you're doing your best and i feel like something here is just conflicting you mentally you're confused about something okay you're confused about something this is your you guys' energy as well no this is libra you could be dealing with the libra and taurus as well okay but there's something in the air that's been hanging around in the air. And you guys are playing a waiting game on something, okay? You're playing a waiting game on something. You're waiting something out. All right, so let's get into the tarot and let's see what's what. You guys, come on with me. All right, what message is there for Taurus for February? You guys had an interesting overall message. Let's see. Let's get down to it. What message is there for Taurus? What's coming ahead for Taurus for February? We got the Six of Cups. Okay. I'm picking up on Pisces' energy. We got Queen of Cups and the High Priestess at the bottom of the deck. I feel like you're tired of someone trying to say something about you, about your past. Okay, about your past. Okay, let's see. What is the challenge here? We got Knight of Wands. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy, but somebody's going back and forth about the past, okay? Somebody's going back and forth about the past. Let's see. What else? Okay. Seven of Pentacles. Okay. You're disappointed in the decision here, in someone's decision here. Okay. You're disappointed. What's the past energy? Okay, judgment. Someone's judging someone. Maybe you feel like somebody's judging somebody. We got the emperor, which is the father card, king of swords. Definitely someone in a high position, possibly someone older than older than you or this person. 
is a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or an Aries. Okay. What's the future energy? Four of Pentacles. Okay. You're holding back. You're resisting, but you really could feel like this person is being irrational and all over the place, and you could feel like this person is spreading lies, okay? You might feel like this person is spreading some lies. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Something here also I'm picking up on, uh, you might be focusing on saving your pentacles, saving your money, but I feel like you want this situation to come to an end. And you want to start, you want a new beginning, you want a fresh new start, okay? Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Okay. You feel like you've invested, okay? You feel like you've invested in this person because we got the Ten of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles, okay? This could be someone in your family, something that you've been dealing with for a while, Okay, you feel like you've invested into this situation and ooh, the devil and the three of swords could be dealing with the Capricorn, but this is some negative energy here. Okay, I feel like you want somebody to get over something. Okay, you want somebody to get over this. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Why is the Knight of Wands here? Why is the Knight of Wands here? The strength card. Okay. Something about some type of truth. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries is revealing some type of truth that they've been holding back. Okay. That they've been holding back. Why is judgment card here? Why is judgment here? Why is judgment here? Knight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Ooh. Something is coming in quick, okay? Like I said, you're not happy with the decision, okay? You're not happy with a decision that someone is made, has made. Interesting, 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 interesting. Interesting, interesting. Very interesting. Very. Hmm. What additional messages are there? What additional messages are there for us? What additional messages are there for Taurus? What additional messages are there for Taurus? What additional messages are there for what additional messages are there for Taurus? All right, we have invisible and playful. So maybe you are turning a blind eye to the situation, okay? You're turning a blind eye to the situation. Give me one more card. Give me one more card for Taurus. I'm getting like trying to play something off. Meditation. Okay. Meditation. I feel like there, there was a storm, some type of chaos here. And I feel like you're trying to turn a blind eye to the situation and act like the situation does not exist. Okay. I'm gonna grab I'm gonna grab a few clarifiers. Okay. I wanna see why invisible is here for Taurus. Why is invisible here for Taurus? Okay. We got the seven of pentacles and the sun. Okay. Hmm. Something needs to be brought to the light. Okay. You're waiting for something to be brought to the light. Okay. There's some regrets. You're waiting for somebody to regret something. Okay. I feel like... 
Why is meditation here? Yeah, look, I'm getting like pray about it. I'm getting like pray about it, meditate on it. Got the Queen of Cups, okay? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy, communication. Someone's asking for something here. Five of Pentacles. Someone could be coming to you when they need you, okay? You may feel like you're going to tell them, um, pray about it. Four of Swords. Why is the Four of Swords here? Huh? Four of Swords. Why is the Four of Swords here? The same cards just came back out. <laughs> King of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, Eight of Wands, Moon, Magician. Wow. Okay, so. Someone left something, abandoned something, left something behind. Queen of Pentacles and the King of Cups. What is this? Why is the sun card here? You're waiting for somebody to realize something. Why is the sun card here? Hermit. Mm -hmm. You're waiting for someone to realize something. Okay. I feel like you're turning a blind eye to a situation like... You don't want to be, you don't want to dwell on it. You don't want to even, you know, think about it. All right, Taurus. So I definitely do feel like you guys may need some advice on how to move forward. Okay. So we're going to get some advice from the angels and let's see what the angels have to say. Okay. So please give me advice for Taurus. I don't know. I just feel like this heaviness um, energy off of this reading like someone is really possibly like you know need some need to face a situation okay i'm not sure if turning a blind eye to the situation is the right move but i know that taurus you know can push some can push something off and you know keep it moving but let's see, okay? You guys are really stubborn. You guys have stubborn energy. Let's see what message is there for Taurus, okay? All right, see, we have multi-face. All right, so there are many layers and dimensions to this situation that you're asking about, okay? So this situation has multiple layers to it, okay? So that's why I just feel like ignoring it is, is like not really going to solve the issue okay if this is your story all right let's see give me one more card give me another card for Taurus please all right yeah see we got clear negativity release negativity from within or around you okay the situation could be real. You might feel like it's negative and you just don't want to deal with it because you just don't want to deal with the negative part of it, okay? You might feel like, I'm too good to deal with this. Like, I'm over it. You need to get over it. Um, and you may just feel like the, the situation is negative, okay? I want to pull one more card. I need one more card for Taurus. Give me another card. Give me one more card for Taurus. I'm just being called to get another one. Let's see. All right. See, look, we got revealing true self. I feel like it's time for an intervention. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, we got divine intervention. Okay. We got divine intervention. All right. So... God sends miracles to answer sincere prayers. You may need to get together or find support in a group, okay, on how to deal with this situation, Taurus, okay, because we have spiritual or religious community. 
join with like-minded people for friendship and increase spiritual growth okay so you may need to in order for you to deal with the situation you may need to come together as a group okay but we have revealing true self as you allow others to know the real you you'll feel love for who you truly are okay so you need to be real with yourself in this situation reveal who you really are okay reveal your true self to you know to this person because i'm just picking up that this is something that's serious it's just what i'm getting and i feel like if you come together you know pray about it meditate on it to get the answers that you need okay in order for you to move forward i feel like you guys are just kind of shutting it out and that's really just kind of like masking it and covering it up putting a band-aid on it you know i feel like you should you know completely deal with it okay so that that's that wound can completely heal okay all right guys i hope that this message was helpful um and if this message resonated guys leave me a thumbs up don't forget to comment share with your family and friends and if you're new don't forget to click the bell to subscribe okay until next time ciao for now